Hi, this is Justin from Tech65 and today we are here at the LG Optimus 3D launch. Today we have here, of course, the LG Optimus 3D uh, and we're going to take a first look at it. It's a very exciting phone, a very unique 3D phone with that gives you the full entire experience of 3D all the way from creating 3D content to sharing 3D content and enjoying 3D content on your LG phone. So let, let's first... Um, look at the hardware itself okay uh, the screen it's a 4.3 inch screen um, and it, it's pretty much the normal 400 by, uh, 800 by 400 in um, megapixels but what's great about this phone is that it comes with a 3d stereoscopic camera two of them over here both at 5 megapixels and of course uh, but when you take a 3d video with this, it's actually downscales to only 3 megapixels, okay? And uh, of course, there's an LED flash over there. So, um, one of the things that I forgot about this uh, LG uh, 3D camera thing over here is that if you ever drop your phone and if the camera itself misaligns, so that, that, that's why you have two cameras, right? So if it misaligns, uh, most of the time, majority of the time for 3D cameras, it will it will not be able to realign itself. So you'll get blurry images when you take a 3D uh, video or a 3D photo. But uh, LG has uh, integrated this thing called a real-time misalignment correction algorithm into here, automatically readjusting if there's a misalignment of the cameras itself. So it will always be great 3D videos or photos that you take. So uh, it comes with uh, you know the normal Texas Instrument um, one gigahertz, very common with the all the other LG Optimus phones. But what makes this different is that it comes with a tri dual architecture. What what this means is that it comes with, of course, the dual core CPU. Not only that, it comes with the dual channel and dual memory. What that means is that it actually doubles the uh, you know the transport space thingy you know essentially as a consumer all you need to know is that it makes your phone faster and that is what the LG Optimus 3D actually provides you so now let's take a look at how we can create 3D content with on this LG Optimus 3D um, let's go into the camera itself so the camera application over here just click on it and uh, you can easily switch between 2D and 3D by just flicking over here there's a button over here to flick between 2D and 3D. If you can take a look, right, it's in 3D content. And uh, it's, it's actually... It's actually 3D. I don't think you can able to see in the in this video, but uh, it, it's really, really good 3D uh, uh, screen. And of course, there is also another button over here, which is a 3D button, a dedicated 3D button, which enables you to uh, switch between 2D and 3D. It's just like a toggle, and it, it, it pretty much affects almost every uh, uh, application out there, except some of the really on the streaming video part portion. But, you know, um, I'll show you that later. So, like, for example, over here, like taking a photo, right, I can switch, I can press the button, and it switches between 2D. I quickly press the button again, and I can switch back to 3D. All right, so another thing that's, interesting about this camera application for this 3D is that you can actually adjust the depth of field. So it is in this um, circle icon over here where you can actually adjust the depth of field, right, so that the image itself can either pop out more or less depending on whether, uh, uh, how you want it to be done. And of course, after taking a photo or video, right, there needs to be a gallery, right? So the, uh, the, the gallery application is, um, it's all available in 3D, which uh, allows you to view the 3D uh, images and videos. So if you can take a look here, right? For the videos and the photos, it would have a 3D logo beside it at the bottom. So it tells you that it's actually a 3D content. All right. One of the interesting thing about this 3D content is that it, you can actually view it in both 2D and 3D by of course pressing the same button over here, right? In this, uh, the 3D dedicated button. So yes, when you take a 3D photo, 
you can toggle between 2D and 3D. The same thing with video also. So over here we have the uh, camera gallery application and we all just want to show you how the, uh, the 3D effect is like and you know putting it to your HD, uh, your, your 3D TV itself, okay, displaying over there. So we have here over here the HDMI cable out to the 3D TV and uh, we have a, con a 3D content that we can play, output it to the TV itself. So let's take a look. So it's displaying over here on the screen the 3D content, okay, so uh, pretty much very clear and, and it, you know, if you have the 3D glasses, you can actually see it really pop out very much, okay. But what's so great about this LG Optimus 3D in this gallery is that it, for your photos and videos, it can actually convert from 2D to 3D. As we can see over here, this is a 2D video of the same thing and uh, we press the 3D button. And it actually converts it into a 3D image itself. So if you can see it on your HDMI, uh, sorry, your HDTV, your 3D HDTV, it will display it as a 3D image or a 3D video. So the LG Optimus 3D actually comes with three games preloaded. Um, I think it's Asphalt 6 uh, and I'm not too sure what are the games, but... Um, <laughs> There are three preloaded games that are in it and there will also be seven free downloadable games available for you to download and of course a one LG World application. So let's take a look at the 3D gaming experience here. So let's take a look at Let's Golf. So like, like the whole experience of gaming itself, right? You can actually turn off the 3D effect and you can actually play the game in 2D. Right? But however, if you want to play the game in 3D, all you need to do is just keep, just press the 3D button here again, press the 3D button and it will, you'll be able to see everything in 3D. So really, really great stuff. The other thing that's very interesting is that in, in the future, hopefully, uh, there will be an upgrade, an update of this software that allows you to convert anything that's on screen to 3D. From 2D on screen, anything that's there to a 3D uh, effect. So that's upcoming in the later versions of the LG Optimus 3D. So let's talk, take a look at the software itself. The software is actually running Android 2.2 Froyo and uh, it will be upgraded to Android 2.3 Gingerbread. Uh, hopefully by the fourth quarter, uh, estimates would be probably about in the October, November time frame. Hopefully, um, and um, that's pretty much it. It's the, the the software itself is very similar to what we've seen in the LG Optimus uh, Black and the 2X. So it's very very similar to what uh, LG has to offer. So the LG Optimus 3D will be retailing in Singapore at all three telcos at the end of August at a re suggested retail price of Singapore dollars $938 including GST. Thank you very much for watching.